Do I got broccoli in my teeth? Yes? Can you see it? Oh, wow. Anyway, get away from that. Hey, everybody. It's Ashley. I am here sitting in my spare bedroom where I practice yoga and everything. And a lot of you might already know me. I am a group fitness instructor at um, the college I work at, Miss UM, in Moorhead, Minnesota. Yes, Moorhead, Minnesota right next to Fargo. I live in Fargo. I'm actually here in Fargo right now. And it's negative 14 degrees outside with lots of wind chill. So I like to stay indoors in the winter. Um, but anyway, this video isn't about living in Fargo in the winter, even though I could be, I could go on for hours about how I don't really like that. But stay positive here. Stay positive. Like I said, I'm a group fitness instructor at MSUM. I'm also a health and fitness coach. So I, I'm here to help you get into the best shape of your life, but that's what I want to talk about today. A lot of, uh, quite a few people have actually come up to me and said, you know, I love going to classes. I, I work out all the time. I love working out. Now I just don't know what to do about my eating. Like that's the biggest problem. And it's really hard for me to be like, oh, I know exactly what to do because I struggle with that. Heck, I'm sure 99.9% .9 of people who work out struggle with eating. Like, what to eat, when to eat, how to eat, um, how are they, why are they not getting better results even though they're working out five hours a day? That might be the problem. Maybe you're working out too much. But if you've heard the saying, the abs are actually made in the kitchen. And the best exercise for getting six-pack abs, which I don't have uh, yet, is to walk. Walking away from the kitchen. So the best exercise you, exercise you can do, walk away from that junk food. Just do it. Um, but it's not just about eating less either. Eating less is actually um, kind of a myth that you have to eat less to lose weight. You actually have to eat um, eat less junk, but eat more good stuff. So like vegetables, all that stuff. And what I'm actually hoping to do is to create a group here. And I'm coming to you, so if you're seeing this video, this is like only a couple of people seeing it. Um, create a group that is a group of just people like me, like you, who are um, are having trouble with you know eating? Maybe it's emotional issues you're dealing with, and you tend to overeat when you're stressed, or maybe it's just you don't know how to cook. Maybe you'll never learn how to cook, and you're really interested in some good recipes or easy ways to make your life you know easier on you. You know easier eating, and or heck, maybe you're a college student, which I teach at a college, I'm almost still college age, maybe you're a college student and you can't afford to eat organic and people are like, oh, eat organic, it's better for you. And you're like, I can't afford broccoli. Ah, how do I do it? Well, I actually want to, I've come up with a few tips and things and I want to be able to share those among this small group that I'm doing. And it's not really a challenge group like I've done in the past, like 30 days to a better you because after 30 days, it's like, eh, if it's all. This is going to be a group that we can communicate to each other and talk about eating and we're going to share amongst ourselves and I'm actually going to do um, put a little bit more focus in this because this is one of my passions um, it's something that I struggle with a lot so I really want to do better so if you guys are willing to give it a try and you want um, the best results of your life um, because then I highly recommend this group I don't know if you're you're probably you know, you're probably eating perfect, you're probably healthy as ever, you probably got abs beyond abs, and muscles beyond muscles, and eating like the best diet ever. But if you're not, and if you are like me, who struggles with food on a daily basis, um, who struggles, you know, financially getting the right foods, who struggles uh, emotionally, because I'm a stress eater, definitely stress eater, and, or if you're someone who um, doesn't like to cook, doesn't know how, I mean, this group might be for you. It might be something that could really help you um, benefit your body, your family, and or maybe you're even a, a mom or soon-to-be mom, and you're like, well, I got to teach my kids to eat healthy, or soon-to-be wife, and um, your husband doesn't eat very healthy either, so you want to be a good influence. So that's also a really good option um, if that's what you're dealing with, too. If you can see here, I actually have broccoli, and this is... I, I do eat healthy, I do. But I have a big sweet tooth and I love junk food. So I have a problem with that because when I get stressed out, I like pizza and brownies. A lot of them. So anyway, 
I like, I can't use the excuse anymore that it's just holiday weight and it's going to come off because it's well past the holidays and we need to get going. Um, so I got broccoli and, um, what is it, cucumbers, um, stir fried and coconut oil and um, liquid aminos. A lot of these little tips and things I've learned in meals, I've learned actually from the best program that I've ever done which is um, the Beachbody Ultimate Reset. It was three weeks of ultra, ultra clean eating, and I felt amazing. You're not supposed to work out at all on this. And the only time I've ever seen results in my fitness, in my body, is when um, I've really buckled down and focused on my eating. So during those three weeks, I actually lost like nine pounds, and I felt more energetic than ever before. I'm not selling this program to you at all. I don't care if you buy it. I'm just proving a point that um, when you do focus on your eating and you do eat better, you're going to feel better. You're just going to feel better. So if you want to be in this group, if you want to try, it's kind of a test group. If you want to try it out with me, I mean, you have nothing to lose. There's there's no like entry fee or there's no really requirements other than I really want us to communicate and get together and do this and be healthy and yeah, so if you're interested, just um, let me know. Leave a comment. I have already a couple people in our group, and we're going to get going probably in February. So it'll be a, I'm going to say it'll be a 30-day deal, but really it's going to go on. You know, it takes 21 days to make a habit and to break habit. So at least 21 days to get us jump-started and going strong. So um, I'll be posting a lot of different things. And so if you're interested, I can give you a little bit more information. And I'm also going to share a lot of personal information too. A lot of um, struggles I've I've been through and how I've overcome them, and I want um, you guys to share it and do the same. So I'll talk to you later.